Hey everybody, it's Stephanie Old World Gamer, and welcome back to more Civilizations. And, well, it's been a couple days since I've been playing, but I think I'm going to Egypt to have a look around, so... Let's uh, bring some cavalry over here and see what we can get. Uh, the other ones, though, I think I'm going to just, um... Instead of invading Egypt, I might make them go and explore. I'm not 100% sure what I want to do yet. So I'm just slowly bringing down these, uh... Units one at a time, and as you can tell, I've also added the music back in, but it's at a reduced level now. So uh, that was a bit of a, a noobish mistake on my uh, part, but uh, you can still hear me through the other commentary anyway, so it should be fun. And it doesn't look like Egypt even wants to talk to me. And I'm fine with that. Whatever, Egypt. already got one fortified there, so, uh, yeah, let's move him. Um, where are we gonna move him to? That's a good question. Uh, I don't think I wanna screw around with India. Maybe I'll make him go over here by Egypt as well. Move! Get out the way. So, yeah, um, this may be a slower part here, so, um, I'm not sure how long it's going to take me to be able to build up to be able to take out some of the bigger civilizations here, but eventually I will take them over. That's not an issue at all. Oh, well, there goes one of them. So I might wait for stronger units before I take over Egypt, maybe. I don't know. Ooh, Ooh it looks like I was able to uh, take out one of them just then. That's a start, anyways. Let's see if Egypt retaliates by trying to attack my unit. I have no idea if they'll do that or not, so... Now, let's go and look at the production of this city. Seems like they're making stuff pretty quickly right now, so I think I'm going to actually send a catapult as well. So let's uh, get one of those going. And we'll get this militia to go down here on a diagonal. Oh, looks like there's uh, some turmoil in Egypt. I should go back and try and take it over. Oh, I might have a chance. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. I won't bring the militia down slowly but surely. They're not going to do too much damage either, but... Uh, I'm not exactly 100% sure how some of the um, attack goes in this, so that's something I should look up, but eh, I never really bothered to do that when I was playing this game. And I've never had an issue, really. I mean, I know that there's going to be times that I'm going to be able to kill stuff, and other times I'm not, obviously, so. And it looks like they're sending a catapult down from, like, Rome, I think it is, maybe? As long as they don't attack me, uh, it's cool with me. But I should go and see where Rome is, because I'm sure they're they've got a nice big, you know, plot of land developed and got lots of irrigation and aqueducts and all these cool cities and stuff. Who knows? Uh-oh, they're still upset about something, so that's good. Uh, I know I said I didn't want to... Ooh, population of Britain is 700,000. So I know I said I wanted to go and explore with these militia, but... I really want to take over the Egypt town there. If I could do that, that would be a huge bonus for me. Oh, looks like they got over their revolt. Oh, this could be good or bad. Probably bad. But this, oh. Good luck, cavalry unit. Yes. Yes! Army of Britain occupies Thebes. Oh, funds of... Whoa, 10? 
gold have been looted? That's not much. We got a barracks there, and we have a granary. Not too much there, but... Egypt has been destroyed by Britain, so there you go. Egypt's gone. So I took them out. That was not too bad at all. That was a very decisive move. I'm glad I did it. Um, yes, I will leave it as a phalanx for now, and I'm also going to fortify that city with um, the militia, hopefully, when they come down. Because I don't think I'm going to bother with the... Um okay, let's put up barracks there. I don't think I'm going to bother with... Um sending the cavalry around yet until I have um, the militia down, so. And let's defend our nice little town there. And the population of Britain is over 800,000 now, so that's good. It's probably because we got Thebes. That's very, very nice bonus to add for us right now, so that's good. We're, we're building a pretty nice civilization right here right now. I need to build some more roads, maybe. Violence in Thebes has been suppressed. That's good. They've all accepted my rule. So that's a good start. Hmm. That catapult there. Uh, unit. You will defend. Jeez, we're growing fast. 900,000 now? We're gonna have a million people in, like, no time. Now, we also need to make a settler down there so we can actually start making, um... I guess I won't need a catapult either now. Uh, I should go change that. Uh, production! Change to settler, please. Thank you. We'll make a road down to Thebes and then we'll irrigate around it. And that should be a very nice thing to do there. Oh, wait. Yeah, Emissary from Rome wishes to speak with me. Yeah, I'll accept. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll gladly take monarchy. That's great, thank you. We're gonna take literacy, huh? Oh, you wanna go to war with me? Yeah, I figured that as much. Empress OWG is that is that what it <sighs> We are most pleased So I guess I'll have to move away from them Oh so Rome has a town there now hey And they oh we're happy to go to war with you if you don't go science yeah, you think so? Don't worry, I'm still going down to the uh, southeast there. Actually, first, let's go in here. Let's go into armed forces. Thank you, Mr. Cavalry Unit. There we go, now I can see again. And we can explore. I'm very excited about exploring. That That's going to be quite nice, I must admit. We haven't done too much exploring yet, and uh, that's something that I usually do a lot of in this game. I usually have at least one unit always exploring. And it seems I went on the offense more so than anything else, so... Okay, we do not need... or do we? No, let's build a library for now, and once it's done we'll build another settler. Oh, we're we'll be able to uncover new stuff. Wait, no. It would be nice to have a, the road that's up there to the north coming down over the mountain and into the city there. That would be quite nice. And we could irrigate a little bit more around if we wanted to as well. Aqueduct is made in London. Very nice. Okay, so let's see what we else we have here that we can make. Um, first, um, let's go make a settler, and then once that's made, we'll um, get a new wonder of the world going in London, because we already have the lighthouse, and we have the um, 
Colossus, so that's going to be uh, a nice addition if we can get some more in there. And it looks like we just found another peninsula of land by the looks of it. And I'm just going to start building that road down to Thebes. Thebes, some people call it Thebes, I've always called it Thebes. Uh, and parts of land in the outskirts of London. Well, bring it on. I don't mind at all. We will kill you outright. No thought about it. Ah! Emissary from Babylon? We just to speak with me. Yeah, I'll accept that. Happy to go to war with me, are you? I will teach you nothing. Uh, I demand payment of tribute. Hmm. Fine. I guess I'll have to move away from you as well. Yeah, I didn't think there was going to be anything there. That's fine. Like I said, I'm going to keep exploring as much as I can. I don't know if we'll be moving into the new age soon. Uh, oh, there, that guy's dead. Boom! There go your pirates. And let's see. Ooh, nice. The settlers have made their road. So, let's move down here. Keep building that road there, settlers. Ooh, botanical garden was made in Madras, India. Well, I guess we won't be making that one. Okay, so... What? Emissary from India wishes to speak with me. Sure. Why are you all the way down here, dude? Uh, engineering, yes. I'd love to trade for engineering. Can take astronomy? Well, seems like they're being nice. And I'm most pleased with you, but uh, I'm gonna ask you for money. Okay, just figured I'd ask. Okay, well, we got some patches of ground there. Let's go to city menu here in this one. And we do not need any more defense on there just yet. We have a militia and we'll have a phalanx to now, so let's throw a temple in there to make the people happy. Uh, somewhere they can do, uh, they can pray and, you know, follow their religion and stuff if they want, so. Uh, and you can defend there, sir. So, I'm, I'm wondering what the Indian government are doing down here. Maybe they're just exploring like we are. I don't know. They made of a settler in London? Okay, so, looks like India made the, um, the, what is it, the botanical gardens, so I'm just wondering, do I want the pyramids first? I'm going to change this by passing through anarchy. No. Maybe Copernicus's observatory, I'll go with that for now. 25 turns is not that bad either, so... Um, I want to find little houses. Ah! No! <laughs> and now I can make them start irrigating this turn as well, which is really nice. Okay, so, um... Hmm. I don't know who the next people are I'm going to attack, or have to attack, is I'm thinking it's either going to be Rome or, um, India. Um, I don't know, maybe, I don't know. I could have attacked the Babylonians. I have to wait until they do another one of those reports, like, the str most strongest civilizations in the world. Ah! Okay, so the Indian dude is there too, I did not really notice that just then. <laughs> Okay, so it's a good thing I'm sticking along the coast, apparently. 
Yeah, I'll come back and irrigate once I'm done with the road. The road is mo mo more important for me right now, I think. Okay. So, things are going pretty well. Uh, again, I know these episodes can be slow just because, well, there's not really much to watch, honestly, so... But, um, yeah, I think I'm probably going to end the episode here for today, but uh, I hope you are all, uh, are all enjoying, and, um, oh, looks like we're going to find another peninsula there. And hopefully, uh, if you have any, uh, if you have any comments or maybe you have some, uh, I don't know, tips for me or something, so next time I play, I might be able to do even better. That would be great, because this is kind of a game that I would probably stream as well, so it always helps. As always, thank you all for watching. I'm Stefan the Old World Gamer, and I will see you all soon for a new episode. I'll make one last move. Ah! The Babylonians. See ya. <laughs>